For today's video, I will be making an art and a craft. So here are the materials that I needed in order to create the craft that I want and also I will make a drawing. So here are the materials. So first, I will fold the illustration board into two parts and I will use the other part for the craft and the other part for the drawing. So kids or whoever is watching, Please be careful in using the scissor because you might get hurt when you don't handle it carefully. So, set aside the other part and use the other part. Using the construction paper, I will fold it into strips and make it as a border or a frame on its four sides. So, fold it and then I will cut it and make sure that the strips have equal parts or equal parts because to make sure that the frame is balanced. So you need to put the strips and paste it on the side of the illustration board. Did you know that I made this video at night time because I really love the peace that the night gives so peaceful and calm and you can think peacefully so i made it at night So at this part, I will be making circles in order to make flowers. So any circles will do anything that you have in the house that you can make use of trace. After cutting the circle, then you need to fold it. Depend on you if you want a six petal flower or a four petal flower. So fold it and then you can, as you can see, it will be cut the way I cut it. So, tada! So, other circles, you might be making other type of petals. It can be also pointed or the one that I got or I made at first. And to emphasize the flower, you should put it or have it a highlight. So you need to pick a darker color if the flower or the petals are in a lighter color. So I choose color black. 
to make the color uniform, I also use color black as a highlight to the other feta so they have the same background or highlight. So as you cut the the highlight of the flower, you can say that you can see that it it looks like it has a shadow. So it will be nicer to do this. A little reminder: when using a glue or a paste, just put a little amount to in order to um, in order to make the flower clean to look at because if it you will put too much paste or glue in it it might be it might not look nice so I made circles for the center of the flower to emphasize the flower so circles just three circles So, tada! The circles emphasize the flowers more. In order to add life to the craft I made, I will be making a butterfly. So, just copy what I'm doing, fold a construction paper into two parts, and then like form like a heart shaped and ta-da! So in order to emphasize the butterfly too, you should have a highlight or like a background on it. So use a little bit of glue to make the image nice. I really got confused on how I will put the two butterflies. So I think or I had an idea to put like points or like dots on it to emphasize that it's a butterfly because people might get confused seeing the scrap. Making a craft or anything that is related to arts really takes time, process, and effort. So what we need to do or possess is to be patient and just be creative. Even if it's just simple, just express or use your imaginative ideas in order to create crafts or drawings or any artistic materials that we can do in our homes, in our house, for our school, or just for our recreational activity. Making arts like this or a craft like this um, relieves our stress because we were able to make time or to relax or to make our ideas into reality. So using the other side of the illustration board, I will be drawing or creating a drawing. So at first I was sketching, then I got confused of 
what object will I draw so but at the end I was able to make my drawing into a creative output so I'm not good at this but I'm trying my best to show my artistic side so I was able to come out with an idea to draw flowers Drawing shows our artistic side, our effort to not just create a colorful output but in, for us to show or express what we feel inside. So through drawing, we, we can also be relaxed. So it takes time, process, and effort. Just patiently make it and you will be, you will be having a beautiful outcome. So I darkened or colored the sketch that I made in order to emphasize the drawing. So this is what I got. And then after this, we I will be putting the life of the artwork through um, coloring it with the chosen colors that I want to. So before that, let's just erase all the traces that have been left by the drawings using the pencil. So that's it. First, I get a problem in choosing the color, but I was able to find ways to, in order to fix it. So, through using cotton, I was able to erase all the, like, make the texture of the color into a soft one from a rough texture a while ago. So you can choose the, any colors that you want or you choose or pick in order to give life the drawing that you are making. So this is my drawing. It's simple, but it's beautiful. Through what I did, I was able to make a poem. Art of Life Tell me what art is and I'll tell you it is life. What is art for you? Is it just a painting, building, or a sculpture? Life is an art and art brings life. 
from the past, present, up until the future. As we look at ourselves in the mirror, what we can see is a masterpiece made by our Creator. Art is within you and I. It's what we have that we can just hide and deny. Never say you're not an artist. We are born as an artist, making our life an artwork sketching our past, painting our present, and building our future. Oh, that needs hard work. We are not just planning for tomorrow. We are crafting the best life that God let us borrow. Life's like a painting. It is made to show something. We are made with purpose. We are just nothing. Inventions, creations, and even decisions we create Artist has visions and missions to complete. The art of life is a process, like solving a puzzle and putting together the pieces. As I grow up, I find life not easy. Sometimes it makes you tired, confused, and lazy, not just inspired and happy. How good God is for making an art like you. He made your family and friends too, so you'll never be alone and feel blue. How perfect God is for making bodies of land and water. All the days of our lives, all His wonderful creations we benefit and enjoy together. The world we live is God's creation. Please, don't put it to destruction. The world is precious and beautiful. This is an artwork that gives us life we should be thankful. Every dark side in life we need to survive. Being positive is what we need to thrive. Plans are part of our today, but how we work hard determines our future someday. In art, we can make erasures. In life, our failures gives us a wound and left us a scar to treasure. It's a treasure for the lesson it gives us will help guide and mold us. As the sun rises, it signifies other chances, a sign that we need to embrace changes, a chance to make our lives better, be positive and not bitter for it matter. Life is a rocky road we need to take. The best version of us, strong and brave, it will surely make. Never let anyone take your place. You're building a life of art. This is not a race. Let our dreams come to reality. Don't let the better future just become what ifs and curiosity. If problems are getting overwhelming, pause, don't stop and feel its rhythm and just continue dancing. Thank you.